Thrilling overtime victory here in D.C. as Lafayette takes down Bucknell by a final score of 4-3 to three on a late goal by Audrey Sars. I'm joined by Audrey and Molly McAndrew, but first we're going to talk to Coach Stone. Coach, overtime win against Bucknell within five days. Is your uh, heart rate still very high <laughs> over that? Yeah, this one this one uh, kept the fans on their seats, I'll put it that way. Um, it said to the team, "There's it's gritty, um, a lot of heart and passion. Uh, you, you can't win that game if you don't believe it. Um, so incredibly proud. And for our leadership, these two in specific, to step up in moments when we had to. They've, they've been doing it all season long, and I'm just really happy that they're able to get three points from uh, a really, really hard work um, a hard-working team effort um, against a really, really good Bucknell team. And then uh, you kind of mentioned this with the back and forth. I thought every, you know, every blow was taken, and then I, there was an answer. Uh, can you just talk about the message, maybe, with the team every time you know something happened and how they had to overcome adversity a little bit to get that win? I think in sport, you know that there's going to be situations that happen. The you know the the game is created based on turnover and transition and um, adaptability. So whether it's uh, you know whether it's a bump, a bounce, a bruise, a call, um, you know any team has to make sure that they hunker down in those moments and solve whatever problem and task is in front of them. Um, So with that said, we we had couple bumps, plenty of them. Um, but again, the consistency and the optimism and belief that it's coming. And um, th- again, we we ultimately performed in the moments that we had to, to tie it up and then win in overtime on set pieces. And that's everything. So well done to the team. American on Saturday at 12 at their home turf. What's the message to the team between now and then? Right now, they're going to recover and get some food. (laughs) That is the message. It's very important, actually. Uh, Yes, that literally is the message. Um, And then just, you know, take tomorrow as it comes, and then uh, next game up, and that game Saturday. And um, it's great. Uh, Two great teams and battling for a championship. I think any coach kind of wants it this way. So um, we're in a good spot. Awesome. Well, best of luck, Coach. Thank you. Okay, I'm here with the two players of the game, Molly McAndrew and Audrey Sars. Molly, we'll start with you. Uh, first goal of the game very early on. Uh, how did you think that really helped you guys' momentum throughout the game? We just really wanted to come out firing, come out fast, and just setting the tone. So I always think scoring first is a great way to do that, put the other team on their heels, get the momentum going in our direction. Awesome. And then, Audrey, uh, same kind of question I asked uh, Jennifer. Again, within five days, you have two overtime goals against Bucknell to win. Uh, you just don't want to score in regulation to, you know, end it there. You want to get, p- keep it exciting in overtime? Yeah, we like to keep it exciting. Um, I think it was a strong team performance, though, um, and it was just awesome to be able to finish here. Awesome. And then one last question. Same question for both of you guys. Molly, we'll start with you. Uh, Again, in 2019, we're in a similar situation. You beat Bucknell to play American on their home turf in the championship. Uh, You guys were in that game. Can you talk about what the difference is now and what you're going to do to prepare for the championship game? I would say that that year we had a great team as well, but this year's just felt a little bit different in that it's just been a really special group, and we felt it all season long that good things are going to happen. So... We're going to go into that game just preparing how we've prepared all season long and hopefully get that result. Yeah, we have some serious strengths on this team, some really awesome incoming players that have really changed the atmosphere um, and just the skill on the field, and I'm super excited to watch us compete. Awesome. Well, guys, get some food and relax, right? Get some food? Okay. Awesome. Well, back to the bus. Congratulations, guys. Great win against Bucknell. Again, the game is against American on Saturday at 12 p.m. right here. It will be on ESPN+. For the Lafayette Sports Network, I'm John Sabino.